prior to headed to Clemson, South Carolina next week. And Casado, the freshman, fits it in a tight window. Jalen Weidemeyer. This will be it. They blitz it. Mon wide open. They get the touchdown. And look at the throw on first down. How about that? Touchdown to Jalen Weidermeyer, his tight end. Play action fake. He has to get pushed in the pocket a little bit. He had his eyes on him the whole way and absolutely puts a dime. <laughs> <laughs> Almost offsides right here again. Advantage Derek Brown. And now Mon third and eight. Over the middle. It's complete. Converting on third and long again over the middle. The same route from a tight end this time. You see the big dig route over the middle. Two up about 15 yards. He loves it. He loves this throw. He feels very comfortable in it. So you can get in a third and long situation. Pocket holds up this time over the middle. That's complete. It's wider wire. Take the jet sweep. Touchdown, Jalen Weidermeyer. At the 18, just under nine to go. Mon hit, releases a ball, and it's Weidermeyer for the touchdown again. Well, remember this offense was built about a tight end last year, J.C. Sternberger, and this time the ball is thrown perfectly high. Xavier McKinney had no chance. Mon has been their real threat. He goes over the middle. It's a big catch by the tight end, Jalen Weidermeyer. Field is open. You see the linebackers, their eyes getting caught in the backfield. Allows Weidemeyer to go right down. Mon finds Weidemeyer for a second consecutive play. Spins off the tackler. He's got back-to-back -back first downs. Let's get... I think it was Jay Sternberger. You could argue the running back position took a big step back, but the tight end position unlocks the pass. Remember that 43 nothing loss? Yeah. <laughs> Here's Mond over the middle. And he's finding his tight end. Another big play is not just a catch, but a catch and run from Jalen Weidermeyer. They have an eternity right now. Don't really need to push the tempo. You're going to see him go no huddle, but they might take their time. Averaging 2.9 yards per carry. First down throw from Mond coming near side. Jalen Weidermeyer. And watch Weidemeyer put his head down, trying to get it. Does he get that ball over the pylon? <laughs> no, no. No, but Kellen, Kellen <laughs> is exactly that, and yeah. he fits well for what Jimbo and his offense likes to do. Well, he gets hit again. This time he gets it off to the tight end. Weidemeyer breaking some tackles, stays on his feet. The youngster to the house. Touchdown, 52 yards. Made equal anymore. He comes over on his crossing route. Kellen Mon again with two guys in his face. Gets an accurate football to Weidemeyer on the outside, and then you see. And loves him. Had four catches last week. There are some young studs on this A&M team. That's one of them right there. Clock under 30 seconds. Pressure comes up the middle to the end zone. Touchdown, Watermeyer. Spiller comes in formation. They'll fake it to him. Roll it out near side to Weidermeyer, and he'll have the first down and a lot more. If we come back for the years, maybe we have can to go see that, right? Yeah, I mean, check that, that out. That looked pretty extravagant. Mond over the middle pass. Caught Weidermeyer inside the 10. He's down to the 8-yard line. He didn't throw their first catch, or Osman didn't catch his first pass from Kellen Mond until they were at IMG Academy. In a conference in rushing yards per game. Mond swings it out to the talented tight end, Jalen Watermeyer. Mond keeps it, wants to throw. What a catch! It's Jalen Watermeyer again. Cross, and TJ Brunson, the linebacker, is actually great coverage. You see him spin, track the receiver, but you cannot beat that type of ball location. Great catch and an even better throw by Kellen Mond. Mond has started this game three for three through the air. Jimbo yesterday recounted the story how he introduced Muschamp to Saban. Out of the backfield, it's the tight end. Weidemeyer's got room. What a nifty move, and he takes it into South Carolina territory. Play action in the backfield, catches the eyes of Jamar Brown, the true freshman linebacker, and gives Weidemeyer the space. 
And he's special when the ball's in his hands. And he from Georgia? Is it, yeah, no, coach, it's okay. He played at Georgia. He hates Georgia Tech. It's okay. Mon flicks it out. It's Weidermeyer again. And another big play. All three receivers are up top. Mon has time and got it complete. And it's the tight end. Weidermeyer almost took it. This had to be a perfect throw to stick it in there. Look at that angle. LeCount had a shot for it, and at the end, it was Tate Crowder, I think number 30, that just tipped his toe. So they give him a little bit more leeway. Georgia going to bring an extra guy. They'll come with four. Mond, a third and long connects. And it's a first down to the big tight end, Weidermeyer. Right in the middle of this zone. Watch when he lets this go. He's got the corner he's looking right at. That ball's out a yard. Throw it out in the flat to the tight end. Georgia can't bring him down. He's got the first down. Remember, this is a true freshman. He's going to be a future superstar in this league. The field against the Tiger defense a couple of weeks ago in Oxford. More pressure this time from Stingley off the corner. Flag down. Mon with time and a wide open tight end, Jalen Wondermeyer. Quarterback's best friend on third down is a tight end that has some speed, some range. 